Welcome to today's uh, episode. This is your host, Fully Armed. Now, um, I did want to go over something, and it's real quick, but it's something that I see... Ooh, lag. Um, something I see very often, right? People have a lot of questions where to find macros um, and how to open them and put them on your computer. Okay, so we're going to go over it real quick. So... Let's go over here. Here is the Discord for B Swarm Macro Community, right? Now, in this community, a lot of people say, hey, where can I get the macros and everything else like that? If you look here, where you see my mouse going over, there is a place called Macros. It has all kinds of macros. So you go to information. Um, we have a G Drive. By the way, um, the G Drive is attached to the comments on our on a lot of our videos. If not, go to About Us. I have it there. So you go on the G Drive, or you go to um, another macro, right? Uh, for example, you go to B Swarmers. You see that they have all kinds of macros: field, compile, bug, and everything. So you come over here to the macro. You see my macro it's you see how it ends in a dot zip dot zip um mcr mcr is actually a macro file file so once i download it and i open it it should open up right as a macro um and i'll go ahead and download it also so you can see it so come over here oops before i do that okay so let's go back to the community let's go to information we send everybody here here's our g drive so you click on our g drive All right don't worry about that close that okay hey if you have a hasty b check out my macros right over there so you want you know the field macros okay no thank you then you come over here to the three dots over here you tell it a hey, download is going to say zip downloading zipping file okay um and then what you do is you go to downloads right um i'm putting it in a folder but pretty much you go to downloads you see it there you're gonna you don't need no um what is it zip czar or winzar or any of those things to open it microsoft window automatically when you right click you see this button extract all click on that it's going to tell you what to extract by default it will extract it in the same area that I'm at so that I'm in so I'm gonna hit e extract there it is and then it open it for me so you see it opened the file right in the same spot then it come over here and here they have the gingerbread snowflake bug run over here they have another zip extract all right in there and here's a calibration guide and here is the two macros okay um that's how that works so for example you go ahead and click mines because mine's a little different um because the way i just have the field so I'll download it there's a zip file right um boom it's telling me hey my fields are ready so i'm gonna just open it drag it into that new folder i'm going to drag that one into that new folder too new folder okay here it is here's fully arm i'm going to right click i'm going to extract all you can de-click this so it doesn't open up that extra window okay there's my right there click on there it has a readme file go ahead and read it a lot of great information i'm going to go over it right now uh BSS macro. Here's the macros that I usually run. And if you go to field macros, there's all the fields. And that's slot four. But, anyways, that is how you zip. Okay. Now, if you have JitBit already installed on your computer, all you have to do is click on the macro. It will open up JitBit for you. Okay. Just like on the other guy, remember I downloaded his .mcr folder? Look at that. Just open folder. Oh, I moved it. That's right. Sorry, that is my fault. Uh, go over here. All right, so uh, I, I moved it from downloads to here, so that's why I couldn't find it. Just double click. 
Noah versus Zombies right there. And there's his macro. Okay. Um, but I just wanted to go sh uh, over on how to open up a zip file on Microsoft Windows and how to open up a file so your jibbit opens up because a lot of people have questions. I, I'm in the G drive, but I can't open up the files. Well, unzipping it is free. All this stuff is free. All this stuff works on somebody else's computer. So after you unzip it and everything else like that, then you have to calibrate it and all that good stuff. Okay. Well, I just wanted to show you how to unzip. I hope this video was very informative. Please check out our other videos. Please like, subscribe, share, and let other people know that we're here for the community. If you guys have any other guides or any other information that you guys want, please go ahead and let us know. We are trying to get more videos you know, out to you guys more often. Thank you very much. Bye-bye.